Hey, 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 it's Terry, aka Crazy Paisy Lady. What's up, everybody? Happy freaking St. Patrick's Day. Y'all gonna get a drink of a green beer later? Um, probably me. Yeah, I'll have me a few beers. Uh, there's nothing wrong with that. You know, we all got, a, got our own time, and when we decide we're gonna quit doing things. Uh, happily to say that yes, finally quit smoking. Eight freaking days, no cravings. I beat it finally. Woo! Anywho, so reason why I'm popping on here is I want to ask you if you want to do a QA. Anybody wants to know anything about me? Uh, what's my channel about? Who am I? Uh, I'll give you a brief insight. I'm a twin, a fraternal twin. Uh, I have another sibling, it's, and, and it's, a, it's my sister, another sister. Uh, I'm happily married uh, to my soulmate. Uh, we only knew each other 26 days when we got married, and we've been married for 30 years. Uh, I have three beautiful daughters and four beautiful grandchildren, three grandgirls and one grandboy. I'm a starseed. Uh, I'm a psychic. I uh, believe in God. I worship only God. Um, if you're wondering what a star seed is, a star seed is you make a contract with God. Long, 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 thousands of years ago I did. I made a contract with God to come here and to learn what it would be like to be a human and to help humanity. I, I knew this since I was a little girl, but I didn't know what it was. I used to sing, I like to teach the world to sing in perfect harmony. Grow apple trees and honeybees and snow white turtle doves. Yeah, it was, uh, I like to teach the world to sing by the new seekers. Um, yeah, my husband, I don't... <clears throat> I sang uh, Close to You, and I knew it was him when I met him because I, I knew that that was my soulmate. I'm all about music. I play a lot of music over on my Telegram channel. You know, it's either Crazy Paisley Lady or Terry with all capital letters, T-E-R-R-I, A-K-A in small letters, and then Crazy Paisley with a capital C, a capital P, and a capital L. Uh, I have a channel, obviously, because you found me. I'm also over on BitChute. I only have one video, um, but I'm gonna make a whole lot more because you know this is about everybody changing everything. Don't go, don't. I always want to be a talk show host, okay? I wanted to ask people questions, learn about the world, help everybody. So who says I have cut the middleman out? That is how I am. Here I am, larger than life, fabulous. I am. I don't know. I ain't like, I ain't like, uh, I don't know. I'm not gonna drop no names here or anything special celeb or anything here, but I, I do deeply care about people. I'm quite interested about people, around, everybody around the world that would like to know about your cultures, where you hail from. I would like to learn about more things, interview people, you know, what not have you. Um, uh, some of my ma most favorite podcast people is what led me to realize that I can do this too. Woo! And I already was thinking about it though. Uh, because I want to help people. I want to teach them what, you know, what I know. I have a head full of knowledge that I really want to get out there and help people because that's one of my jobs. I help Star Seeds, her new activate, newly activated activated, figure out who they are, where they hail from, why they're here. In the best way I know how. And a lot of that is, you know, I give, I share videos. There's more knowledge out there in this world than in me. We all learn somewhere. So I share videos from my favorite psychics that know things, people that really know what they're talking about, because you know, I don't, I don't take things for everything for what it's worth. You take it for a grain of salt and you feel it out, because that's what I do. Um, Oh, and, and on my cha my channel on Telegram, that is, mu I play a lot of music. There's a reason I play music. I'm very intuitive. And when the spirit tells me I need to give a message to the world, it's, it's people are sad, whatever it is, a, a message. And I don't know who it may need to go to. It could be for the whole world. There's a song or 20 songs or 30. 
I could get up in the morning and I could just boom. And it may not resonate with you that day, but one day you're going to go on my channel because you need to listen to music and I play great music. Um, and it's going to be in there. It's going to be what you need to hear because I get, the, I get the messages. This is what I'm here for. I used to have Facebook. I quit Facebook because it's a cesspool. I mean, why the hell would you want to be in a cesspool? I mean, I didn't realize that I was trapped there for fucking nine years, nine years. <sighs> yeah. I had some beautiful, beautiful friends, beautiful friends. I still have them in my heart. I want them to know that I did not leave them at all. Please come and find me. I'm over here on YouTube, BitChute, and Telegram. And I just I just miss your company. I miss talking to you every day and, and what we learn from each other. I'm a very social person, but I don't go anywhere. I had an accident. I screwed my knee up on a trampoline, and I destroyed every ligament. And then I got surgery, and now my leg's, like, really messed up. And, yeah, I... Long story short, I'm okay. I have fibromyalgia, so I don't go anywhere. I can't work a real job because, yes, I do smoke marijuana, but it's medical marijuana. Uh, there's nothing wrong with it anyway. I did not know this. I used to think it was this I was in a classification of this bad, 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 bad thing because it's all put in your head that it was bad, but it ain't bad. It ain't bad at all. It is the greatest, one of the greatest medicines I ever put in my body. I, I couldn't get out of bed. I hurt terribly. I felt like I, w I was, that was it. I'm going to die. This, it's over with for me. What am I going to do? You know, I, I won't see my kids. I won't watch my grandkids grow up. Nothing. You know, this, I didn't know what was wrong with me. And then they're like, they all, they can go, oh, well, oh, you have fibromyalgia because nothing else came out. But like after researching and whatnot, and then I went through all these drugs pharmaceuticals, you know, because pharmaceuticals are better. Yeah, bad. no, they're not. You choose what you want to do, okay? If you feel comfortable taking a pharmaceutical, you go take that pharmaceutical. But I prefer herbal remedies because don't you care about your body? I care about my body. You know, up until last year, I obviously did not care about myself. I I weighed 276 pounds. Don't ask me what I weigh now because it's the whole... I'm scared to look at the scale thing, but I know that I've lost a considerable amount of weight. I'm in a large pants and medium shirt, and I wasn't a 26, 2 to 3X, so yeah. And, and you know how I did that? It was healing. Healing is so, so important. If you can't heal yourself, how the hell are you going to help anyone else? That's what I keep telling everyone. Because I know there's so many people that have these giant hearts and they want to help people because they know what it's like. They've been through hell. They they see, you know, they know that they've been broke. Uh, they know that they've been abused. They've been, you know, they know people, you know, something terrible tragically happened to them. But here's the thing. You heal yourself from within. And that's what I did. I changed my diet completely. I used to run around going, well, I don't really eat the sweet stuff. I, I just eat meat and cheese and I like potatoes, you know. And I thought about it. Hmm. Well, then maybe something's wrong. And I have IBS, but that's part of fibro. But what's, let's just see what happens. Let's shoot for the wind, you know. I'm doing all these changes anyway in my body. I'm going to become a vegan. What the ha what the fuck? Let's do it. Let's let's try this shit. You've tried it before. If it works, it works. Whatever. Immediately, I noticed the difference. I mean, I am not kidding you. I I, 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 I like felt better inside. My my intuitive side came out stronger. Um, I everything just started falling into place. I mean, it was part of my awakening. There's awakenings. Believe me, there's awakening. You have, uh, you can be awake and you can go back to sleep because we all hit that button. Let's hit this news button because I ain't dealing with this shit. Um, there is spiritually awake and there is spiritually awake. I mean, when you combine it all, there's so many levels you go to. Nobody's got it figured it out. There is no damn race. You learn everything different. You go through so many different things. And the only thing, and I can tell you, that if you feel like you are one, if you are a light worker, a star seed, anything, 
the best thing you can do is surround yourself with people who understand you and are like-minded. It is amazing because when you realize that there are so many of us throughout the whole world, like so freaking many people, and 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 that what we are all if eventually going to be capable of doing with our minds. I mean, for crying out loud, they say we only use like what 10% of our brains. Like why? Because they're dumbing you down. Ooh, better be quiet. I might say the wrong words. Anywho, turn the TV off. Get some good tunes in you. Go out in nature. I live in the woods. I moved from a very crime infested town that I call the concrete, all towns, most of them I call them the concrete jungle because they're full of all that negative energy. And everyone knows as they go to a picnic or they go camping, go to the beach, the lake, whatever, you know, you feel better because that's where it's at. Right now, you can't hear it because uh, I'm indoors and they get louder though. They do get really loud. I have spring peepers, froggies, and I live in the woods. So they're all around me and it's... Some people may think that, oh my God, that would drive me crazy. But me, it's it's a lullaby. It puts me to sleep. It, 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 it soothes me when I'm in, out, outside or just sitting here. I'll hear, all of a sudden I'll hear it and I'll just enjoy it. It's like taking in the sun, just basking in it. I love animals. I'm a huge animal lover. I could put that in there. I, I could talk for hours, obviously. I'm sure there's a bunch of other you out there like me. There ain't nothing wrong with you. Not a dang thing wrong with you. If you want to talk, you talk. Don't let people tell you when your batteries be run down. I've heard that all my life. And and it makes me feel like I'm, I'm I wasn't a good person because I like to talk. Like so who knew? Maybe I should have just been like a motivational speaker speaker or something in my life. Maybe I should have been, but a lot of motivational speakers, in my opinion, as I just said, in my opinion. They're only out there to do one thing, and that's rob you blind. Uh, I don't want to rob you blind. Yes, this is my day job, my night job, whenever the hell I need to do job. But I'm not about scamming anyone. You, I mean, I don't have a, I don't have a uh, PayPal channel set up yet. I will have one set up eventually. And the only reason is, is I'm struggling with that because I know a lot of people get these ideas that people have these channels just so they can get rich off them or they're using people or whatever. But you know what? Really? Because everybody had an idea in life and they decided to do something and they got paid for it. Whether you got a boss or you have a business and this is a business. I mean, they don't have like DJs anymore, really. They do, but they're all getting, the industry is not as good as it used to be. Um, I'm also working on other things. I got a partner I'm working with and I'm going to have him, him on my channel too. He's amazing. Why do you get to meet him? Fabulous. Hey Dave, I'm giving you a shout out. Well, I'm not sure what he's going to actually go by, but yeah, I call him Dave or Moo Moo. He is a brother from another mother. I, uh, actually recently only met him recently and it was like, I, uh, I don't know, like I came home, he was a family member and I realized, and that's the thing, that's why I say surround yourself with family, because that's what it is, we're family, surround yourself, because you're going to go through so much crap, you'll notice your mid swings, they're going to go off to church and you're going to be like thinking, oh crap, I'm losing my freaking mind up in here, up in here, but you're not losing your mind. It's a, your body's changing. There's chemicals. Once you figure it out, everything's changing, you know, because you're like, oh, wait a minute. How can you be an alien? How can you be a star? Hey, have you heard of junk DNA? Figure it out. Don't take everyone's word for it, though. Get out there. And, and I know you had to hear people say it. Do your research. Look it up. It's there. If you want to know something, it's out there. Um... Anyway, so I'm going to let you go at this point and tell you all I love you. Please, please, I hope, I'm, I, I'm probably going to have to set the settings on like 16 and older or 18 and older. I apologize because I want everybody to be welcome 
I'm not always going to have videos where I'm swearing or using content that's not right. I love children. They're, they're very important to me. And I think that I would like to do something for children. I, I love to read. I write. I, I would read them children's stories. You know, I have amazing, amazing ideas. And, I, and um, they're part of this planet. They're part of our lives. And they, you know, you never should talk down to a child. You just get down on their level. And, wow, bring a little kid in your life. Ah. Oh. They light up your life. Can you imagine if we had like a story time where they could just, mom, dad, you can sit down and normal people are sitting there reading a story, not somebody you don't know. A normal person. Somebody that, I'm not, well, I am a normal person. Everybody has something. Everybody's different. And and, and I, that's why I'm out here today to tell you this. Be yourself. Do you see how I'm dressed? This is me every fucking day. All the way straight. I wear what I want to. Yeah, I may look like a little kid that don't know how they dress themselves, but it makes me feel comfortable. There's too many people wearing clothes saying, that's not in style. I can't wear that. Or da, da, da. No, be you. You be you. Or, oh, I'm too fat. I can't wear that. It won't look. No, I just, that's too cute. That's for little. No. Because I remember being in Walmart. I was getting ready to go to a Stevie Nicks concert. Love her. Hello. Anyway, I was getting ready to go. And this other woman that was big like me, she said something about, I didn't know they had such cute clothes here now, but I'm really scared to give it because I'm, you know, I'm so heavy and everything. And I'm like, girl, you need to get to living. You know? How long are you going to wait? you going to wait till the day you die or till you finally lose weight? Be you. Because when you are you, then you can be you truly be you all right that's it i'm gonna go because if i'm not gone i've already been on here like 16 minutes so if i don't go i'll be here all day because i love to talk and i i'm getting equipment for my show so i we can set it all up and 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 then we can do the whole q a and we can talk and i can interview people do whatever i'll bring you on we'll, we'll make you famous let's do this shit yeah right blessings Peace. I love you. Have a wonderful St. Patrick's Day. And everyone, just be safe. Love one another.